this is Manuela from Xandria. You are watching an interview on heavyworlds.com. We are talking about tour, about music and about much more. So enjoy watching and rock on till you drop. Bye! So we are here with Manuela from Xandria. Welcome to heavyworlds.com. We are really glad to have you here. Uh, so today, Xandria are here in Milan with uh, Epica and Stream of Passion. Uh, how is the tour going so far? Oh, it's great so far, really. We had great concerts in um, Lyon, Lausanne, in Belgium with Stream of Passion. And yesterday we had a very great concert at Rome. Um, the people there were really great, so I'm also expecting very much of tonight. Um, this is your first tour without uh, Nils Middelhoff, your bass player, who injured himself on stage before the tour. Uh, his replacement is uh, Fabio D'Amore from Serenity, who you've been in tour with during uh, Out of the Dark Festival. Uh, what could you tell us about it? How is Fabio? Fabio is a great bassist and he's really a very great person. I like him very, very much. Of course, it's sad that Nils cannot be with us. But um, with Fabio, we have a really wonderful replacement and he does his best at all the shows and we are really glad to have him with us. We were very lucky that he had time and that he joined us for the tour. Uh, today you are in Milan promoting for your latest album. How, how has uh, the fan reaction been so far? Oh, it has been very positive. Um, mainly, of course, and um, I was very nervous before the release because you never know um, how people will react to an album, but um, I would say it's really mostly um, positive and, and that's what, what makes us uh, sure that we are on the right path with our, with our music and I receive so many nice messages every day on Facebook and um, fans seem really accept me as a new singer and they seem to really love the new album and we are very happy about the outcome and about this reaction. Uh, I know this album took a long time to compose and write. I also know Marco writes the songs, but uh, how does a song in Sandra's style start out? Well, I don't know um, actually how, how Marco does it really because I haven't um, been um, from the very beginning on, um, from, the, from the start, I haven't been uh, in Xandria, you know. Um, I've been, I joined the band in 2010 and there al already almost all the um, material for the new album has been written. So I didn't get so much of the actually process of the, of the album writing, of the songwriting. Marco told me um, that um, Concerning songwriting, it's like that, that he get ideas everywhere, you know, during car, <laughs> driving the car uh, or from books, from films, um, from personal experiences. And then he has some melody in his head and composes the other stuff around. Um, it's somehow like this going on, but um, I don't know in detail how it's going on. <laughs> I will um, experience at the next album, I think. <laughs> uh, for this tour, you guys have a bunch of new songs. What's the set list like for this tour? Well, we have um, a time of 35 minutes, so there's not too much space for, for many songs, but we can um, play six. We'll play one old song and five new songs, but, um, well, I don't know if I can tell <laughs> already which, what, is, what the set list is, because it should be a surprise for the, for the audience, you know. <laughs> but uh, we have five new songs uh, with us, and for me it's very great to, to perform the new songs. It's actually the first time, you know, because um, at the Out of the Dark tour um, we had only Valentine and Euphoria with us, and um, we had many old songs. And it was not the same for me in singing because um, the old songs were not made for my voice, but the new ones are made for mine. So it fits more perfectly. And I'm very happy per that I can perform them, f them finally on stage. Yes. 
Mm, as I mentioned before, you guys were here uh, for uh, Out of the Dark Festival. What do you remember from this, this experience? It must have been great sharing the stage with such good artists. Yes, it was um, great to getting know so many nice people, you know. Every, we were really, we, be, we became like friends during the tour. And um, it was also nice to see them on stage. And um, the whole tour was really um, harmonic. And um, I have very great memories concerning to it and still when I look at the picture I'm like oh it was so nice <laughs> yes it was wonderful really I, I miss them already <laughs> but Fabio is with us now from the last tour so that's quite nice <laughs> that's great <laughs> yes <laughs> of course we are still um, uh, I'm still in contact with some of them and um, we try to keep contact it's not so always so easy because everybody is very busy but um, it's easy over Facebook you know you can write a short me messages and um, we still have contact yes that's very great um, and Heidi from a variant on even invited me to come to Finland once so I hope I can do that <laughs> yes. uh, would you like to make uh, some collaboration with one of these bands yes why not yeah I, I could imagine well I cannot um, collect one of the bands but uh, would be great with all of them. So if you want to make a project with me, just <laughs> call me. <laughs> okay. Uh, this year you've been sharing the stage with uh, Epica and uh, Stream of Passion. Um, have you started to get to know each other? Yes, of course, especially uh, with Stream of Passion because we are on the same tour bus. So you get to know each other very well. And um, we share a great time together, um, even after the show, we sit together, we talk a lot. Mm -hmm. And uh, yes, also with Epica, we have a little talk here and there, um, eat something together, and it's really nice to get to know each other. Yeah, and talk about music, of course. Yes, it's great, like it. Um, it would be really nice to spend some time with the girls. Uh, you mean with Marcella? And Marcella and Simone. Yeah, well, I, I spend a lot of time with Marcella, of course. Um, with Simone, not so much, because she's also very busy. But uh, yeah, it would be nice. Uh, what are your plans for after the tour? Will there be more tours uh, or are you planning uh, on taking a break? Well, actually, um, since yesterday, it's clear that we also do the tour in May with Epica. Um, it should be already posted on Facebook. I don't know if it is, <laughs> but uh, we'll do also the May tour. So um, this will be the next one. We'll have uh, one day off after the April tour and then start the second part of the tour with Epica again. And uh, I'm very happy and the others too that we can, can do this. And well, in the summer we want to play as many festivals as possible. So I don't know yet which festivals it will be, but... Um, I hope a lot. Okay. Um, I know Marcella sings also opera stuff and Simone keeps taking singing lessons. Will we ever see you singing any of uh, Puccini's operas or operas by other important composers? Well, I don't know yet. Um, I, would, I would like to do something like this, of course. But uh, just right now I want to focus on, uh, on the metal stuff and I also have a project next to Xandria. It's uh, more in the Celtic direction. I like this style also very much. It's more an acoustic way, you know, with piano, with uh, um, violins and uh, flutes and so on. And I like this also very much. So I want to focus on these both. But perhaps you will someday hear some classical stuff of me. Yeah, of course, why not? I like it very much, yes. I heard you visit Florence uh, some days ago here in Italy. What do you think about this city? Oh, it's wonderful. And uh, we ate very much uh, ice cream and pizza and it <laughs> um, the churches were really beautiful, you know. I was really stunned when I saw this and we went uh, on the river. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know how it is called, Ponte Vecchio, Ponte Vecchio, yeah, Ponte Vecchio. Ponte Vecchio. Uh, it was very nice, the sun going down and I, I really enjoyed this day. It was very good, yes. And what about Rome? Have you had uh, some time to visit it? No, unfortunately not. <laughs> I would really 
uh, like to visit it once. Um, I've been just once there uh, with Haggard, but we only saw the Colosseum from outside, but nothing else. And uh, it's sad that we didn't have time to visit Rome. I'm very sad, but hopefully next time. Yeah, maybe next time. Yes. <laughs> Um, okay, that's all for now. Thank you for your time. Is there anything you would like to say to your fans or uh, Heavy World's readers? Yes, first thank you for the interview. It was uh, very much fun for me. And I want to uh, thank you all um, for the great response to our new album and for accepting me as new singer of Xandria and I I really appreciate that and um, I hope that I see many of you uh, on our concerts. So take care. Thank you. Bye. Just before the show, we all lay our hands mm -hmm. together and <laughs> everybody shouts something different. And one shouts, Xandria, and the other, yay, and <laughs> good luck. <laughs> something like this. Yeah, that's our ritual, yes. <laughs> I, think, I think it brings us luck. 